Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of As Far As You Can Tell. I'm Joe, with me today is... Andrea. Rachel. Ashley. JP. And he is the one who knocks. Fred! Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> um, <laughs> and we are an actual play Pathfinder game set in the Zodiac Empire's campaign setting. Um, to give you a recap of what happened last time, the party... Did went some stupid stuff. I'm trying to think of when we started last time. I know everything that happened. Um, did we, um, where did we start? Yeah, where did we start? I feel like we started go when we were on our way to the actual meeting. Yeah, we just kind of woke up. Yeah, we yeah. we had already gotten out of the, the thing. The raven. The raven? Did we start with the raven? We started with the raven. There's a lot of oh, stuff yeah. that happened with the raven. And then Alric came in and he was like... You're right. You guys were sleeping. You guys had just woken up and we got attacked. That wasn't one session. Mm. No, first session was we did wake up, but it was our, different. We were gonna go. Alric came in. He was bleeding. Alric came in. Came in. Apartment. Yeah. He was he bleeding really bad. Oh yeah, yeah. We healed him up. Yeah. Then we went. The girls had to get ready for the little meeting thing that was gonna take place, the vigil, and yeah, so the boys left. Yeah. And the boys got cornered by the guy who all guys who Alric had been attacked by. We led them to a warehouse where no bystanders could get hurt and we could potentially be ready for them. We fought them. We kicked their butts. Rolled we really away. bad. We didn't actually <laughs> kick their butts. We rolled really bad and we're almost dead. Brad crit me <laughs> like four times, I'd like to point out. I um, think actually four. But then Ho, Raziel, Ulrich, and Rowan went yeah. into the gloom, uh, chased around some dudes, looked into the gloom, uh, got out of the gloom. Because Brad's nice girls. and didn't want to kill us. Yeah. Hey! Hey! hey. Thank you, Paul. Grim gray eyes. <laughs> Grim gray eyes! So, Don't Steve think a lot of NPCs. Um, no. Then we went That's to the vigil. That's obviously a real NPC. His name is Grim gray eyes. Hey! hey. Oh, Myrtle. thanks, Ergo. Hey, thanks, thanks Ergo. We then went to the vigil itself, which we found out wasn't actually a full-on vigil. It was more of a yeah. guise for a meeting of individuals who were concerned with the safety of Dragonheart, um, this whole big little secret society. And we learned a whole bunch of stuff there. I'm not going to recap all of it because mm -hmm. it's worth going back and looking at that one. Um, and then we went to a hotel to sleep and rest mm -hmm. and were attacked again by these members of the Void, <laughs> similar to the guys who had attacked... Um, who attacked us before. They were coming for revenge, basically. Uh, they tried to murder us in our sleep. I was literally sleeping. Uh, they failed. <sighs> I didn't get bloodied. <laughs> and, yeah. The party met in her non-raven form. Luna! 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 We found Luna. out she is a Varen, a.k.a. Dark, Dark Elf, a.k.a. Drow. She saved my life. And I believe that's right where we left yeah. off. You went to zero. Oh, the perception unlock um, for for rogues. Well, I take like half the penalty of sleeping. Like you're more aware when you sleep. What? I feel like after tonight, Vale might think about it. Yeah. Uh, we also leveled up. Oh yeah, we should do our level thing. up. Yeah. We should do our thing where we go around and. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Same. JP, you're now level six. You're playing a bizarre fighter. So Indeed. what did you get last level? Uh, last level. As a fighter, it starts getting kind of not so much boring, but each level I just get another feat. Um, I, I I did things really backwards uh, as a fighter. Uh, I should have I should have taken cleave at like level three, but I went and took it now. Um, there were many times where I was like, man, if only I had cleave right now. Um, uh, but I did redo my math. Uh, I add a lot and add a lot of damage. Um, when I attack, I get a second attack this level, which means my damage just went up by a lot. Basically. Got on average almost 25 damage a round. Um, so that's going to be pretty good. But no, other than that, not too much. Hopefully, I might actually get my full plate soon. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> you might be stuck in the vibrant. Or right, I mean, I don't know. One day. <laughs> one day. I did, however, uh, in the last session, get a ring of protection plus three, which is massive and actually extremely helpful. It's kept you alive. Right. So that that was big, but other than that, Noah just picked up cleave. So you might actually see me cleave some fools. Uh, I at level six got a 
War Priest bonus feat, and I used it to take Vital Strike, which is really sweet for a War Priest because they normally won't have two attacks at this level. Yep. But Vital Strike just gives me an extra damage dice on my thing because it's cool like that. It's nuts because the requirement is bad plus six. But you I get, don't to get use that War until level eight. Yeah, and you get to and use I'm getting it, it yeah. now. So. It's basically like taking two attacks in one. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty great. great. I am Anna the Alchemist. Um, when I <laughs> when I leveled up, I got another discovery. Um, my discovery that I got was Tanglefoot Bomb. Bomb. Professor's assistant. Did you yeah. see a boss said in chat? No. Mm-hmm. Waiting on full plate level three. <laughs> Waiting on full plate level six. <laughs> pretty accurate. Sorry. It is pretty much. Um, but basically, I can throw a bomb that's a Tanglefoot Bomb, and it entangles people. Ooh. Yeah. So that's it can nice. like hold a person to the ground. Cool. Tangle foot bombs one of those things that is always OP. Well, see, yeah. you tangle someone to the ground and then I fly up in the air and just look at them yeah. menacingly. And, and the splash, <laughs> and the splash radio, uh, splash effect is uh, makes it difficult terrain. I feel like and I just cackle maniacally in the sky. It also makes yeah. a lot of sense because we're fighting things right now that keep es- escaping us. So yeah. if there's anything she'd be looking into, it would be things that pin down an enemy. Yep. Yeah. So that's because we cool. need to knock off some shit. Yeah. Oh, we needed to talk about the tattoo. We will. Mm-hmm. But we can do that. Where? Where you're not. Yeah, somewhere. Um, but is, yeah. are you good? Okay. Uh, good. So at level six, I got some uh, like save increases, a bab increase, <laughs> um, some some boring stuff that doesn't have a lot of cool flavor. But <coughs> my danger <coughs> sense went up, and I got another rogue talent, uh, and I used that on Corn Dog and Smash. So I get a free intimidate check um, when I use my power attack, and that allows me to demoralize um, that foe. And because I have the Intimidate skill unlock, if I exceed the DC by so much, I can actually frighten them, um, which is kind of cool. So yeah, that, that's kind of what I did this level. Her build is crazy. Yeah. I just got a wand of invisibility, I looked into yeah. like, the Intimidate oh, road. I almost yeah. started going down that path. That was one oh, of the feats I was going to take. It has was a lot the... of prereqs, but it seems super worth it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. pays off. Well, I, I basically just chose to go cleave, cleave path. I was going to go the Intimidate yeah. path, but um, Cleave is going to be fun, I think, for me. Mm-hmm. I'm Violet. I'm a wizard. She cast uh, the I guess spells. Uh, I just got some save increases. Two new spells. I took haste and minor dream. You get, you get then, another. You didn't get another spell level, so. No, and then I just. But you took haste. Yes, I did. And I also just bought <laughs> dark vision, sheet lighting, glitter dust, silent table, and eldritch conduit. How much would it cost you to make a? Dude, wand of haste. That's the next thing <laughs> on my list. Like literally, then when I, as soon as I have enough gold, I'm like, wand of haste. I need it. I'll just start you putting skill points in the magic wand, device. Uh, then visibility yeah. for you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I would only skill focus while well, uh, use magic device. Seriously, like <laughs> it's not a bad idea, JP. <laughs> Waiting on that Vader full plate, JP level twelve. <laughs> oh, my oh my god! Please. Um, yeah. So that's the whole party and. Waiting on that Zodiac full plate. Maybe <laughs> level 20. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> this melts my skin. It's great. <laughs> okay, so uh, the party, having just dispatched a group of individuals, mm-hmm. staring at a rapidly closing Did rift it, uh, uh, in space time. Minnie, get, get the party, Minnie. Oh, yes. Yeah. I'll just do that because. <laughs> so imposing. Look at the mini. Look at the portal! Look at it! Look at it! Stand up. That's why I like it. Well, yeah, but now people just see a line. It's for me. It's <laughs> just for... I don't care about just that. for Joe! <laughs> <laughs> I just realized that the cameras were out of sync. Anyway. Yeah, they're just a little twisted. We're good now. Anyways. Okay. Uh, uh, well, we... I say we let it close, and then confirm that Vale can open it. Um, did I ever get healed, or am I still literally fucking staggered right now? She gave you a potion. You. Okay. And you, I think you healed 2D, or like 3D or okay, some yep, shit. Okay, yeah, I'm okay right now. All right. I don't know what it was, but yeah, you healed a lot. But either way, I feel like waiting is also... Okay. Yeah. Uh, That's funny, because I don't want to go in. I, I want to go in, too, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to go out. I was already there once today. I don't feel like going back yeah, in Yeah, I today. feel like we're a little drained. <laughs> Can you go home? And I'm probably hungover. Where's home? Probably. We're all home. I'm especially home. The key? Because I rolled really No. Low. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't feel it's safe to stay here any longer. Can we please go home? 
I mean, that bitch couldn't even bloody me in my sleep. Uh, you guys hear a knocking on the uh, suite of rooms main door to the outside hallway. Who is it? Housekeeping. Go away. <laughs> okay. It's in the middle of the night. Hmm? It's a lie. Do we have peepholes? Are there peepholes? Yeah, yeah, like a keyhole. Yeah. Can someone look through it? I'm too short. I hoist Hove up. <laughs> <laughs> you look at him. <laughs> Wait, to the keyhole? <laughs> yes. The keyhole. No, no the, the perception hole. Oh, okay. The perception hole. Oh my god. I just looked through the keyhole. No. Okay. I just have to take it <laughs> What do I see? Six armed Vata Sentinels. Yes. Mm-hmm. I open the door. <laughs> You're not housekeeping. You're right. Uh, <laughs> You're not housekeeping. We heard a disturbance and came to investigate. A little slow. Screaming? Yeah, you heard a little slow. Loud loud noises? They got away. He's he, They all appear to be trying to look around you. Where, where did they go? Opened a portal and jumped in it. Uh, what? <laughs> yep, that's what happened. <laughs> uh, excuse me, sir, can you please step aside? Okay. No. <laughs> uh, okay. Six bad. The sentinels enter the room. There's a raid. As they're coming in, I call out. Sentinels are coming in. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Rachel, there's a uh, raven sitting on your bed. Good. She's under the covers. <laughs> oh. Okay. She's uh, I knew she was. Yeah. They uh, quickly glance around the room at your combat wounds, but no signs of intruders. <laughs> hey, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm still naked. They might think that. <laughs> Uh, they probably think that us drunk weirdos just beat the shit out of each other. I mean, like, you guys all right in like here? The We're fine. Yeah. We're okay. We're just partying. Just We're a long night. Yep. Just a long night. Uh, he, the main guy, the Sentinel, turns and hands you a card. Uh, <laughs> contact me if uh, anything strange occurs, if you remember <laughs> anything else. Is he wearing a ring? No. God damn it. Or any What's his name? name? Don't ask me these questions. <laughs> Brad, you know this question's asked for anybody we meet. What's your name? I have quite the NPC list going on. We keep adding to it. It's like collecting Pokemon. I should get this out. It is. Yeah. I might have to roll them. We're building city today. guys. <laughs> His name is Sidney Schultz. Oh. I like that last name. Captain Sidney. Just say it like that. No. Is that how it's written on the card? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Captain. Captain. <laughs> this guy's a dick. <laughs> Boss wants us to cut Justin's finger off. Wait, what? No. Anyway, uh, he I only need a, a few of them. Take a little peek around, then eventually leave after a few minutes. Very good. Good. Bye. Bye. Thanks for being slow. They don't say anything as they leave. <laughs> I am wearing rings. I have two rings on. What two rings? Ring assessment still. <laughs> I want a ring. I don't have ring of protection. Okay. I only need a few of them. Best statement ever. Okay. What's the party want to do? Hey, dude, you guys just woke up and got attacked and almost How assassinated. Long are we asleep? A couple hours. So not fully rested? Nope. No way. Uh, can we go back to my apartment? Yeah. And then sleep. Uh, the party leaves the party hotel. I get dressed. I hope. <laughs> uh, and heads back to the apartment. You are unaccosted on your way there, walking through the deep snows of Dragonheart. A um, couple guards pass you, some bad the sentinels ask where you're going, if you need any help. You obviously ignore them and keep on trucking. You arrive at your apartment, unaccosted. <laughs> Covered in blood. <laughs> I assume you would have cleaned yeah. yourselves before leaving. Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah, I was. Nah. No. <laughs> I'm fine, I swear. You arrive at your apartment door. Yeah. And just as you go to open it, it opens before you. Luna says, hello. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hello. Oh. Oh. Hi, she's Vale. Hi, she's She chuckles at your uh, remembrance. <laughs> I just will. <laughs> How long does she plan on hanging out with us? Well, I guess that's fine. 
I mean, we can keep her. Maybe. Yeah. Around we can. Her? She's a person. <laughs> She seems time. confused. We'll go to Osef, and then we can keep her. <laughs> oh. Wow. It's going to be one of those, can't we? <laughs> I may even consider an evil creature. I think she might be a little uh, beyond our... We can take her. I don't think we can take her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get some sleep then. Like, yeah. actual sleep, without worried about... I'm going to go to my room and murder. try to sleep. I'm going to put my little guy out so I don't get attacked while I'm asleep. Oh. Uh -huh. Hanzo. He stands in sentry mode at your front door. Oh. Okay. Uh, okay. the night passes on eventfully. You wake up the following morning. That's a sweet thing too. Like a wizard would have that. Okay. Yeah. Hey, you first stand over there. <laughs> Constructs cool. are one of the first things I feel like wizards start toying with. <laughs> God damn. This one because he's a toy. <laughs> All right. Did not take long. Anyway. What is the point? Want hot hand? The other half of this is uh. Oh. Yeah. Open it. Put it in your head. That's how I figured it was going to happen. <laughs> I feel like my head's going to get really hot if I do that. Do I have like a word on this thing? Props. So anyway, um, the following morning, uh, the party wakes up to the sound of, si sound of sizzling sausage and bacon. Who's cooking? Who's cooking? Luna. Why is Luna? She cooks? We're keeping her. Yeah. Does I she sleep? She Not anyway. True. Okay, you know what? Purpose on you for not playing on the trick. Anyway. I eat breakfast. How do I feel about them? I feel like they wouldn't have an opinion of who. A favorite. Yeah, probably not. Like, except well, the whole Windsor Valley considering thing. Considering they're <laughs> underground oh. in Vizarro. So I'm saying, like, Vizarro, like, like an entire. Like this, there's, there's the crust of the planet is in the way. Why right, it? like. I didn't even think about that, but that's such a good thing to bring up because I mean, they a... would have no contact, really. Yeah. No. Anyway, um, your morning goes out eventually. Cool. Are we all a little hungover and sore? Probably. No, you're fine now. Yeah. Yeah. Was the breakfast magical? Um, it was good. It was not magical. It doesn't give me any bonuses to AC? No. It was an eight. You have. Ooh. I don't get a food buff? You get a food buff. <laughs> Well Full. fed. <laughs> Full. Was it nine for me? The bonus is you're not hungry. <laughs> what a magical bonus. Oh. I'm wearing a ring of sustenance. I, I, I ate think. it because. Because <laughs> it's bacon. Like sizzling bacon. Why nice. would you turn bacon down? I was like, I took the ring off. Like, oh my god, I'm so hungry. Put it back on. What's wrong? I want a ring of sustenance. Do you want we my... can get you one next time we go to town. Okay. I don't know how that works, but. What, what ring of sustenance is I call What year were you born? 87. Where was your first job? Who was your best childhood friend? I'm trying to unlock your Apple account. Why? Just give me the thing. The password's always the same. It's it, even with the right password, it needs unlocked for some reason. I don't know. That's weird. Who's I believe. Your best childhood friend, though. All right. What should we do? What's the party want to do? The rest of the day ahead of you. Stay. Stay home. Okay. Do I have books? You wake can up the I next day. Books? Do I have books I can read? Sure. Can I learn more about planes? Sure. Okay, I'm reading. Yeah. Um, Snake I read be more on. of Twilight. Well, I can't. Shit. Yeah. I help you. Well, she has to sleep. Has to be at night. Does it have to be real, real darkness or like starlight? Kind of like reading in a bathroom. <laughs> you don't know. Go try and read it in the bathroom. Can it be any darkness? You should like... try to use your sword. Oh, oh my god. Oh yeah. On the yeah. book? No. It has the <laughs> no. Oh, it's got an it. Wait, what should I do? This isn't this isn't Riddle's diary. <laughs> it has the oil on it, which is essentially starlight oil. Mm -hmm. Oil oil nice. So put like, so your over the sword page. over it. Go in the bathroom. <laughs> you you use you're it telling like... me all this because we're, we're going we're going we're going in the bathroom. Okay, yeah, use it like a viewfinder. Okay, the door shut. I turn off the light. Pull out your sword. Does it work? Uh, as you pull out your swords, it's softly shimmery starlight all over the room. Aww. What are they doing in there? Why do girls always go to the bathroom? We're reading a book! <laughs> I, really I don't get it. it. I don't get it. Hey, you want to go to the bathroom? I no. <laughs> well, I'm going to be locked in the bathroom all day, though. <laughs> i got to poop. <laughs> get out! I like eight bathrooms. <laughs> you have your own bathroom. Oh. Okay. You didn't specify which one you used. <laughs> Mine. Oh. Phew. You know what? 
I if you had went into Vi- Vi- or if you had went into Violet's bathroom, it would just be bookshelves and a toilet. That'd be the best. That's the dream. I know. No, it's a standing shower, so you can read. <laughs> <laughs> she has a little like, window. She has like plastic book sleeves where she can like. Yeah. Act, and they're it's just like a little magical area where water just doesn't go. I'm trying to pat it. Trying to pat it. <laughs> Senpai. Careful. You go into the host bathroom. It's just a toilet. That's it. How do you shower? What? <laughs> I'd have to take my armor off. <laughs> Anybody got time for that? Yeah. What? Doesn't it give you penalties? I took the feet. Can I take your proof nope. <laughs> Voss says Hoven and Rizio go into the bathroom together needs to be a thing. <laughs> Jesus. Why, boss? I mean, you guys can feel free to write short stories. And oh my god. <laughs> I would die if we got as far as you can tell, fan. Please. <laughs> please, no, not like this. No. That would be so great. I I'm would okay stream it. me reading, reading it, it yep. dramatically. Dramatic reading. Oh no. As far as you can tell, fanfic. That would be the if best. It's even, if it's really good, I'll find a cheap um, <laughs> illustrator. <Bus>. and <laughs> You can do some black and white sketches of the fanfiction. I'll do it. Yeah. Erotic fan. Yes. No, please God. <laughs> no, please God. Anyway, um. I don't think it's a purchase, is it? Jesus. Does anybody have anything else they'd like to do? I want to know what the book says. Brad doesn't care. He wants you guys to do things. I would probably read up on mm. the books that I got. I want okay. to. I want to use my super s- high sleight of hand to steal Veil Sword. I am going to. <laughs> you fail. I'm going to write Passive to. perception too high. Holly and Mahoy oh, yeah, right. Felix, I believe his name oh, was, yeah. at the keep, asking them, or telling them we were going to be a while. Um, yeah. I want to specifically look for mentions of planar travel and using the sword to break planar barriers. Okay. Did we get any gold recently? Mm-mm. No. Mm-mm. We gotta send some gold to Felix so he stays longer than oh, yeah. the couple weeks Thank he has you. left. Is it just a couple weeks? Because he agreed to stay for like a month with his men. That was. Like, that was a couple months. Yeah. Ago. All right, well, we can look it up. We have the notes. Rachel, what specifically are you looking for? What does it do? How I think his name's Felix. Get to. I think so. It sounds mm-hmm. right. The gloom. If it if it can. How get to gloom? Your sword. Yeah. In the book you have. Because uh, it's about it, right? Um, Twilight is about the sword itself. Um, oh. I want to I wanna hear what cool shit it can Transfers be. its essence via the vial of darkness. Oh, you are not the sword. In any case, um, it has had many wielders over its decades of existence, or centuries of existence. Decades. Any notable ones that I would know? No. It's a whole bunch of names you've never heard before. Um, I'm gonna write those names down and give them to my wizard to research. Okay. I'm with you. And my alchemist. Because they're both, they both got the int. Yeah. The int. The int. Okay. Hove, um, after a couple hours you get a response. Miss What does it say? We're going to have to deliver this to Holly as she has not been in town for quite some time. Uh Oh. Who? Holly. From, is it from like Felix? No. Oh. It's from the Blue Wind Company in Anchorage. Okay. Holly hasn't been there for a while. Can Blue Wind find people? Mm-hmm. It's part of the delivery of notes. Do they tell us where she is? Not right away. Uh, Rachel. I got worried. Your. Uh, the history of the sword is that it primarily functioned. Mostly in the Night Wars. Ooh. Okay. On the Vibrant. On the Varen side, I assume? Mm-hmm. Not on the... The... Oh, no. This is... This is the... What's the word I'm looking for? Ellerin. This is the... Um, this functions on a... that. It seems to have taken place in a series of night wars that didn't affect the material plane. This is after Synethial made its way to the Vibrant. Oh. So during Synethial's survival. So like solely below. Mm-hmm. Cool. What kind of stuff did it do? Mostly um, killing Fey Lords and various other things, protecting people. Stealing information seems to be its primary purpose. Okay. 
It's gave, it gave its wielder uh, power over sight and hearing. Anyway, anybody else want to do anything else? So the letter was just from Blue Wind saying that Holly hasn't been in town, so they have to find her. Yeah, okay. which we would expect. She has to keep. <coughs> um. Hope isn't worried yet. Did you? This keyboard's so small. I don't know. So as far as things that we have to do. Um, Somebody wants it. Sounds like it. We have to go and get those guys. Go and get what guys? Through the portal. The gloomy guy. The okay. boy. Um. Let me make a to-do list. Um, yeah. Her uncle is on that list. To find out, like where he is, what exactly happened to him, and get him. What exactly his research did? Did we pin that down? No. No. Okay. Like looking through the books. The biggest um, clue is that it gave us more rings. Oh, yeah, yep, the rings. Oh, uh, we need to go chop fingers off. That's definitely still a priority. Mm -hmm. yep. Although it's kind of like cutting off Medusa heads right now because more just crop up. Yeah. So That's Hydra heads, too. Do we want to take oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's do we want to Hydra take heads, Medusa eyes. Yeah. Gouge them out. True. And then they explode. Or she explodes. B, you are so cold. Go away. Elsa. Do we want to recon his estate or go after the boy first or do them both at the same time? I'm for one before the other. Yeah, one before, like you mean split the party or no. together? Oh. Never split. Yeah, definitely no. Except for all those times that we've split. We split the party, yeah. I say we try to take out the boy first because it's like a link to him. I mean, that's yeah. what Hope and Rizzi would probably want to do. Yeah. Yeah. It's also, yeah. I agree. And that's the main Not source. For you. They'll probably <laughs> learn a lot more too by doing it. Yeah. Um, looking through the books, is it like what is the are the contents of it in general? Like, is it just formulas for um, various things? Um, most of it is research that you already know he had done. Okay. It was okay. in the, um, what the hell did I tell you last time? It was in the... <coughs> Hold on. Is it a place? Is it a no, book? No, it's, uh, what he was researching last time. Hi. Jesus Christ, there's what? so many notes in You're here. You're wet. You're very wet. No shame. I'm a unicorn. Unicorn. Boy, what does my throat hurt? Twilight doesn't transfer through sparkly vampire blood. How dare you? As far as you can tell. He said that thing. Oh my gosh, yeah. A fanfic. Oh my god. Uh, most of it is the uh, method of early warning for Curs and Spec Me. Oh, All that's right. right. Okay. Which is relevant to our interest because it's bound to happen, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. How soon? Could you try and replicate what he's done? Yeah. Just in, so, like. You yeah. could potentially get a warning just in case. Oh, that would be cool. Uh, roll a alchemy check. At least start trying to do that. Yeah. yeah. That would be a good ongoing thing for you to attempt. Ooh, nice. 17. Nice. Um, Yay. Plus 16 is 32. It was, plus 16, it was like most of the wall and you're at the top of your head. Uh, 33. Um, it is currently beyond your expertise. Okay. There are a lot of things that, and um, theories and formulas that you don't understand. Okay. Yeah. But you're working on it. Yeah, I'll keep working on it though. Yeah. However, as you go over them, you realize that he has done a significant amount of research in areas that the party already has. 
such as the original rings and scepter, what they do, how they were linked together, um, how to replicate this on a large scale, uh, things like that. Does it mention the second scepter? No. I feel like these two we need to figure out how to de-link them when we finally get the items. Yeah. Yeah. What you mean de-link the scepter? Like in the rings. rings and yeah. I feel like it'd be much cleaner to find a way to turn the... Yeah, like go to the source and turn Yeah, off. instead of just chasing ring after ring after ring. Can we explain could that I, the could I start researching that, like, as we go along, Brad? Sure. Okay. Yeah. I want to go to the library. I want to look at my sword longingly. <laughs> Raziel looks at his sword longingly. And Raziel! Like <laughs> you fall asleep sometime after staring at it for long enough. <laughs> <laughs> and you wake up in that dark place that you were in before. What dark place? Uh, the upside down. The upside down. It's just darkness in all directions. The time oh. you got sucked into a fountain. Oh right. Hmm. Yeah. Plus I can do this. This is the thing that happens. Mm hmm. Just kind of looking around. Nothing happens. Ooh. Okay. Okay. So what's oh. the rest of the party want to do? What time? Happened? It's like noon, <laughs> and Raziel yeah, just fell think? asleep on the couch in the, in the living room. Is he still there? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> he didn't disappear like last yeah. time. No, that's when he went to the vibrant. Yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I didn't disappear until he he said, uh, like, come with me or whatever. I want to go to the Reverie Library, which is also the Ledger Temple. Okay. Not alone. I'd rather not go alone. Edward hey, comes with you. I, I need to see him, my mom. I need him to help me find books because he's do been you, there. For do That's go, fine. Do you want to go alone? Or do you need backup? No, she can't go alone. No, I mean like with him. Like, do you want to do Yeah. Okay. He's going with her. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm in the bathroom right now. But I'd, be like, <laughs> I'd be giving you finger guns if I was out here. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Just making sure you don't Perception make roll, please. Sure, it's a win. I think I made it. I'm thinking wrong. Uh, you're being followed. By? Uh, a black raven. <laughs> <laughs> she's flying above. Oh, she's the wing woman. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hey. Fuck. <laughs> what is life? Oh my Maybe god. Don't hurt, me. <laughs> don't hurt me. I'm slightly. No more. I'm slightly annoyed, but at the same time, don't I'm me. a little don't bit thankful me. because no more. she can fight back. Yeah, she can, yeah. She can wreck some Uh, you arrive at the no river? Yeah. What? Uh, oh. a Amorite at the front desk ask you if she can help you find anything. Books. Uh, historic books. Oh, sure, on what subject, please? Oh, plenty of those. We have a whole section. Oh, uh, she takes you in, and she takes you into a small side room. Oh, a side room? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is my side room. Uh, written in Israel. Do you speak Israel? Yeah. Okay. Uh, above the door is the beckoning. Uh, she opens the door. Inside is uh, three walls stacked with bookcases eight feet high. There's a mahogany table with uh, surrounded by a couple chairs in the middle, a small eldritch okay. lamp in the middle of the table. Uh, he, she mentions that you can purchase a revoicer if you would like to take any of this, uh, remember it for later. Not right now, maybe later. Okay. Uh, if you need anything, just, um, ring the bell. Are you trying to be Rachel? What are you doing? <laughs> 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 you look like in Beetlejuice whenever yeah, he, like, flips his thing. head upside down. Yeah. yeah. Upside down. Um... In any case, uh, she tells you if we need anything to ring the bell. There's a small little buzzer next to the door. Okay. Start looking at books. So okay. weird. <laughs> it actually hurts. After about an hour, you realize that you can't find anything. Nothing at all? Uh, all the books inside, while the titles are correct, the contents are incorrect. Huh? Fluffy bunnies. How are they off? 
Uh, you've looked at about 46 cooking manuals, uh, one, uh, a treaty on fishing, uh, something that dealt with, uh, the history of Juarez City. Someone put a different cover on the book, essentially. Yep. I ring the bell. Uh, after a few <laughs> seconds you hear the pitter-patter of feet, and the door opens. Hi, how can I help you? Why are these cookbooks? Uh, what do you mean? I show her a book. You're in the wrong... Oh, you wanted cookbooks? No. That's over... No, I wanted books on Curtis and Spagnay. Yeah, you're in the right room. Why is it a cookbook, though? But it's not a cookbook. What the the it cookbook's are over... But what? I hold a book. What does it say? Why did you bring a cookbook in this room? They're all like this. I don't know what you mean. I show her the books. Okay. Uh, <laughs> after a few seconds, she, she becomes very concerned you and leaves. You across the face with a book. Bitch! <laughs> <laughs> this is a cookbook! <laughs> It's up with pie! There's some over there. <laughs> when flu attacks? Someone oh had this. Um. Mr. Hare. <laughs> I'm making a list. Cool. Yeah. There's bee hair on my head. Anyway, um. <laughs> She's trying to keep it warm. Yeah. Uh, about a half hour goes by, and uh, Elric's mother walks in. Hi. She begins pulling books off. She doesn't even say anything to you. She just begins pulling books off the shelves, opening them and throwing them, throwing them in a pile behind her. Do you want me to help you? Sure. Just take out the ones that are bad? Yep. Okay. Help her. <laughs> They're all bad. They're all bad. <laughs> Sense motive, is she flipping the fuck out? You're not there. I know. Sense motive, is she flipping out? <laughs> Sense motive, I'm in the upside down. <laughs> How do you know where I am? Yes. Oh. She, she seems to be having a conniption. Publications. Uh. Bear Simulator. God, that name's so great. Bear Simulator? The MLG Bear Simulator. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like that'd be a great game. You're just in the woods. You have to hunt down berries and No, fish. you're, yeah, you're a bear. You have to hunt down the hunters. Oh, uh, that's wow. Daily. You have to hunt down Leonardo DiCaprio and win him an Oscar. You oh, are God. the boss. You have <laughs> to kill the hunters. Yeah. Um, Did you win one finally? Yep. For, for a movie where he gets attacked by a bear. Thank God. I think the bear should have won. Um. She gets to the end. There's a giant pile of books in the center of the table. Any books on the shelves? No. Nice. I asked her when the last time she saw like an actual book in here was, like a book on. I mean, I don't come in here very often. Oh. Uh, she turns to the assistant that helped you in the room. Clean up this mess. Someone's gonna fire. And leaves. Somebody's gonna lose their job. I follow her. Uh, <laughs> as you, as you leave the room, you hear the assistant begin crying in the room behind you. I throw a gold at her. <laughs> <laughs> roll an attack roll. Roll an attack roll. Not to hurt her. I toss it at her. You bitch. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you get. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Crit. I uh, confirmed with a 20. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> One day four points of damage times eight. Fuck. <laughs> She does that. It'll be fine. Okay. Oh, I keep following her mom. Okay. She, uh, she goes upstairs. She begins uh, consulting with a whole bunch of people in the. Uh, uh, overhear anything? A later stuff. Yeah. Uh, roll perception. You overhear everything. Uh, twenty-four. Uh, apparently nobody's been in that room for months, and the last person who was in there was Elric. Oh, oh boy. Done. Done. Is he still there? He's standing next to you. <laughs> What'd you do with him? They were all Curzon's beckoning books when I was in there. Was anyone else in there when you were in there? No, it's just me. I didn't have a girlfriend back then. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Do you have one now? Oh. That's, that's not my name? decision to make. <laughs> Are you asking me? I'm confused. <laughs> I just oh. give him a weird look like confused. Oh my god. Score one for the boys. <laughs> Um, okay, so, uh, JP, uh -huh. after what appears to be about 30 minutes of you wandering around in the darkness, uh, things begin to appear, um, like they're being made of, like, shadow stuff, and then they solidify after a few minutes. 
You find yourself in a small fishing village nestled in between four hills. All right. Um, the streets around you are hard-packed earth. Um, there's no cobblestones of any kind. There's people around you that begin walking around. Uh, after a few minutes, the shadow stuff kind of fades, and you're just in the middle of a town. All right. Do people seem to see me? Mm-hmm. They walk around you. But for the most part, ignore you. What? Stop someone and ask, excuse me, where am I? Uh, what did you say that in? Oh. Did I catch anyone speaking mm -hmm. to this point? Anything I understand? Israel. Everyone. I don't speak Israel. <laughs> oh this has got interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I would try Mavelish, but... I would hope someone yeah. speaks Mavelish. Do you just keep running? Do you speak Mavelish? Do you speak Mavelish? Do you speak Mavelish? Um, eventually you <laughs> realize that a large crowd is following you. This is just you some... Alright, there's a couple things you notice immediately off the bat. Roll perception. <laughs> or not. Or, Depending. Yeah, let's find out <laughs> if this is immediately off the bat with this that one. Oh, you're gonna know. Alright. <laughs> Better than that one. one, he rolled a five. Um. <laughs> But it's just said, oh, it's <laughs> Okay, uh, the first thing you notice, because uh, it's obvious, uh, everyone around you is human. There's not a single other race. Everyone around you is obviously Israel born. Um, um, they're, all the names around you are use what you would consider, um, you recognize some of the words, because you've been around people who've yeah, been speaking of Avalish for so long. Right. Um, but they all seem to be referring to each other as either uh, items, uh, thoughts, ideas, words. They're all word names. That's Everyone common knows. of Israel, right? Yes. Like like I wouldn't even know. Okay. Uh, you. They all seem to be looking at you and pointing at your wings. I begin asking people in Draconic occasionally. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, do you see Draconic? Uh, eventually, <laughs> someone says, I do, from like across the... In speak Vivalish or Draconic? Uh, he says, uh, I do in Draconic. Oh, not somebody who speaks Draconic. But he says it in like broken Draconic. He's like, I... <laughs> yes? I yes. All right. <laughs> I approach. I yes. I guess you could... Would it... Could I politely correct the way he said it? Uh, roll diplomacy. See if I can either piss this guy off or be polite about it. Oh my god. I tried another 20. I mean, it's at least above a 10. <laughs> oh, I had, I had a lot to that. Uh, it'd be at least a 15. Okay. Uh, he, he, he does a muttering, oh yes, yes, yes. Uh, the man you're speaking with seems to be, he's definitely older than most of the people here, but he's not like graying. He's just in his pro he's probably say like mid to late 40s. Um, He's approaching a midlife crisis. He, uh, he has <laughs> stark red hair that is white on like one like strip of it. Okay. Uh, that's the same question. Uh, he, he asks, uh, help you can. Can I assume he's trying to say, how can I help you? Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't want to keep correcting this guy. <laughs> you know what? He doesn't have that much of a chance to, uh, ha uh, uh. Correct his, uh, uh, grammar. me follow, me follow. I follow he, him. He takes you into a, a, like a, it looks like a, it looks like Violet's room if you ripped everything off the shelves and just threw it around. <laughs> uh, okay. he, he obviously, he reads a lot. Um, his books, just not organized. You, but the, you can tell immediately that most of these books are extremely old. They're not made professionally. Um, as you look around town, uh, most of the buildings that you see are made of wood. They seem really uh, basic structures. As you enter his house, you realize that he heats his house by a wooden stove. Um, it not there's not really no elder. I was gonna nothing, say, have I, have no I seen a roads. single like? No, you said no paved roads, no light posts. Uh, his clothes are pretty like homespun. He's wearing a robe. Um, it's it's dyed uh, like a bright red. Uh, he takes you in and he eventually, like, sorts through books and then he picks up a book and then he hands it to you. Uh, it, it's essentially just translates into Draconic 101. Oh, God. 
<laughs> okay. Um, and then he hands you another one, which is, uh, it's like a history of dragons. So this is probably how he learned. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's also written in Draconic. Okay. Do I? Is uh, there... he, he pulls out a piece of paper, uh, after going through his whole thing, and then he picks out, like, a piece of charcoal and begins writing. Uh... His name is. Da, 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 da. His name is Seer. Like. S E E R. Okay. Seer. Um, That's an interesting name. Uh, Seer Scale. His last name is Scale. Like. That's interesting. Scale. Oh, that type of scale. Yeah. Uh, he writes scale and then he, like, draws a scale. Because he probably didn't know what the, was it the right word? Yeah. So he did pick the right word? Yeah. But he wasn't sure. Yeah. Um. He. I believe. Writes down, um. Where are you from? Wait. Bear Uh. Very, very far, he writes. Uh. How did you get here? Fly? You could say that? Um. <laughs> uh, nobleman? Yes. Clothes very nice. My They're just basic <laughs> warrior's clothes. You're like, oh, man, this cost me like a gold, maybe. Thanks. Uh. <laughs> come from large city? Yeah. Interesting. Where am I? Uh, <laughs> dragon. In any rate, center. No. Is there a lake nearby? Yep, you can see it. Did you peer out of this window? Uh, yeah. A really long time ago. I've determined. Before they dug out the wharf and built right. the city and built the walls. It'd be like looking at here. those pictures of like New York. Yeah. Like, and then you uh, you look out the window and you realize that Mount Curzon is behind you, but you can see all of it because it's not in, there's no buildings in the way. Interesting. Does it look like it's exploded before? No. Ever. I feel like I'm here at a bad time. Yeah. <laughs> Good thing you're dreaming. Okay. Am I? You're still on the couch. If you die in the dream, you're still on the couch. <laughs> I'll just become a potato. That's what happens. I would still carry you around into battle. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Lift me! <laughs> You'd put, like, the puppet strings on him, like, so he could swing. Aww. Weekend at Bernie. <laughs> oh my yeah. god. <laughs> Weekend at Rizzi. You could just turn me into a construct. It'd be fine. Totally more, more like I can just start looking into necromancy. It'll be fine. <laughs> It'll be fine. <laughs> I love necromancy. Jesus Christ. <laughs> um, what are we doing to Violet? <laughs> necromancy. Does it even look like a volcano? Uh, well, Dragonheart is not necessarily a volcano, which is a really long no, the, mountain. Right. Oh, right, 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 yeah. Yeah. It doesn't it's just, well. every once in a while, it has some earthquakes, and a whole bunch of monsters show up. Weird seismic activity, and then... Have... Was it ever volcanically active? Uh, probably at one point. Is there hot springs in the sealed? Yes, many. Okay, so, okay. I kind of... Sorry. I want to... No, you're fine. It's okay. I want to think of a way to determine if there's been a beckoning. But I don't know if that, coin, that phrase has been coined. That's what year it is. Yeah. Oh, good. yeah, good point. What year, what is, year it? is it? What year is it? Help. Um. No. Well, I could just ask for the date and hope that he, like, mm -hmm. just gives me the full date. <laughs> he gives you a date that you don't know how to translate. It. He writes it down, but it's something that it's local. They're not. Mm. Okay. Let me keep that in mind. Because I might need to figure that out later. Um, he tells you that it is... One second. Does the, like, fishing village have walls? Defenses? No. Okay. Just dirt. That was going to be my next question. Dirt. How, like, 
started asking about like how quiet the village is. The sea monsters, bad things. <laughs> no, you're fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, he tells you it's the month of the shadow. Um, and he tells you that it is the year. You guys should start building walls. You could be like the prophet that saved the town. <gasps> There's uh, somebody in chat, my friend the alchemist. Hey! <laughs> my friend the alchemist, alchemist unite! Um, just to let everybody know who's currently in chat, we're running a giveaway right now. If we can reach 125 followers by the end of the stream, we'll give away a free copy of, or the digital copy of all of our current material. Which are legit. The campaign setting, player's guide, and four adventure paths. One's like 300 pages. You just have to type star call in the chat. Somebody do the thing. Um... He tells you that it is the 88th year of the Zodiacs. Hmm. They're not necessarily certain what the fuck that means. I wish I was there. Cat burgers. Mm -hmm. I wish I was there. Is that a burger? I don't know shit. Um, but yeah, I want to kind of ask about the... I noticed the... I mentioned that I noticed the Sorry. village doesn't have walls. Do they not see any, you know... Much, it was pretty quiet. No, nothing. Uh, white rose unite. Uh, no outside enemies. This is this is from a while ago. Thank you for the follow. Okay, hey. we have another alchemist. Which white rose? What do you mean, which white rose? It's the family. Ask which one. Yeah. Who's the leader? Oh, right. <laughs> to place it time wise. Right. Um, right. Who's the current leader of the White Rose family, bro? <laughs> Hold on! <laughs> How dare you have to use the source material you wrote for this purpose? <laughs> At least it's in a book. We <laughs> 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 used to just make crap up and then contradict ourselves all the time. <laughs> <laughs> the good old days. I think the worst part of writing was like, these are the details. They're legit. They're staying this way. <laughs> Stop changing them, okay? God yeah. damn it. But what if... No. But no. what if... No, what if... So I have this whole new idea. No. The amount of times that happened. <laughs> yeah. You have no idea. <laughs> we just need to change all this. No, right. Brad. Brad, yes. Brad, no. Brad, yes. And Rachel what just if we just you, like... redid all of magic? <laughs> Brad, no. Brad, no. Yes. What if I redid the Is map completely? What if we redid Silurai guys? <laughs> Yo, let's do it. That that never came up. No. We knew better. <laughs> Joe values his life. <laughs> no, I, I'm. Um, <laughs> winter. I'm getting rid of the links. Winter white rose. I'm gonna start to piece anything together. What? Because JP came, but is Raziel starting to piece anything together yet? No. Just very old. You should have listened to me more. I'm not there. I'm nagging you in your head. Hey, hey, but hey, wait up, wait up. Hey, listen. Like, hey, not even hey, there. Hey. Yeah. You were able to speak to me before. I know, but I'm like in a library. Mm -hmm. Is your zeal sense tingling? I can send you a minor dream. I have a weird right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in, I have inception to the second level. I don't like... Um, okay, so I, I haven't, I think I have a pretty good amount of info to know when this is. So that when, if and when I get out of here, I can start asking questions. Um, weird fishing village. I see, I keep forgetting. Uh oh. You wake up abruptly on the couch. Yeah. I was going to say, I don't know what else I would ask. Uh, ho, ho you, you watch the Brazil goes, <laughs> <laughs> where am I? Do you have a bad dream? Yes. <laughs> I uh, work on it. like I was a poor homeless man <laughs> in a fishing village. It was weird. I word vomit. Huh. Specifically like the time frame things that I picked out so that we could try to work out when 
that was. Oh, so if you notice, happen he was in Dragonheart shortly after the first Curzon's beckoning. Are you sure I know this? You would. Okay. <laughs> so it was after the first. Mm-hmm. So there wasn't. I think I'm that much smarter than Raziel. Just wiser. I think that's the big big. But you you probably would have listened to her better. Is because well, I there's was also wiser. <laughs> there's also the dwarfness. That's true. Like. History's kind of... Yeah, you, know, you are along the race. Are you assuming he's Rachel? And your entire fan, like, you have a college of, like, lore keepers? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just a <laughs> level two on the commoner. Probably, like, the first thing you would have done... Oh, Rec Center's like, here! Rec Center! Yes. Oh, hey, Rec Center, we're having pizza for, uh, dinner yeah. Oh, tonight. Yeah. Just want to let you know. Tell us what delicious thing you have that <laughs> will make us look yeah. like plants. We like to talk about food. I think everybody does. Okay, Ho, what do you want to do today? Um, well, I think we should go talk to Violet. I don't know, what are you doing today? Maybe go read a book. (laughs) Figure out what you dreamed about. (laughs) I don't know. You can go to (laughs) a room and look for books. Yeah. We Maybe could check the room. Let's go in her room. <laughs> are we allowed to do that? I think she said we could. <laughs> Wait, you guys are going into her Violet's room? But did I say you oh. or- Yeah. We need books. We need books. Do you have books? <laughs> yeah, I, I have books. History but- ones? History no. books? No. I guess you can go in her room. <laughs> okay. Oh. We'll see you later. <laughs> uh, we're all in knowledge of history you check, guys, you two. You guys probably... Well, Even though we're okay. not trained. <laughs> okay. I'm trained, actually. Holy shit. I forgot I trained history. What? Motherfucker's <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know what's going on. He doesn't know what's going on. Oh, I, I forgot it was one of my training skills. It's not a class skill, but I actually, like, physically took points oh. in it. 17? If she yelled, you probably like, I don't know, it was okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, 17. So I go 15. You're like, oh, As you go I'm through, uh, Poe finds a children's book on a sealed mythology. <laughs> nice. Talks That's about the perfect. first Curzon's bag. That's perfect. Got That's all the info we need. <laughs> this is about our level. <laughs> about our speed. Jesus. I don't know how I got all these books here this fast, but... What do I learn from it? He paid for um, yeah. he made all our commands. Pretty much that what he Actually, just witnessed is accurate. And so then I was back in time. time. They could hold a lot. We can confirm that. Confirm. Or at least you dreamed that. How vivid was it? Pretty vivid. I was there. Oh. <laughs> Anna, is there anything else you want to do today? No, other than researching the books. Okay. I think throughout like the next like couple of days, I would still keep researching on uh, Kristen's beckoning, like okay. how to predict do it. the predict yeah prediction thing. Is there a hospice circle on the floor? She has her her tail. She put her nose over. Rachel, is there anything you want to do? I'm reading my book. Okay. I'm in the bathroom. If anyone needs me, I mean... Rachel, uh, you read that Twilight used to give its wielders the ability to take short jaunts into a in-between gloom and material Ooh. realm to allow its users to possess fast travel. Does it describe how at all? That This is what I've been looking for, so... Yes. There may be, like, excited noises mm-hmm. coming from the bathroom. Woo! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> You're so weird. Um, Women. However, it lists some problems. Um, one of its wielders was lost into the in-between for a significant amount of time. Um, for the blade, for long enough, the blade to have lost a wielder. Have all the wielders been worshippers of Ural? All of them. Yes. Okay. Um, however, when this happened, the blade disintegrates and reappears in the, um, communion pool. It's literally like a noir blade. Mm-hmm. I do that. You die? Okay. No. Uh, <laughs> He's like, oh, that's interesting. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to look for descriptions of what these people do when they get into it. If there's, like, any type of weird ritual things I have to say. I don't know much. I'm learning how to use magic device. I have... Uh, but, like, I don't know much. So, uh, I'm learning. Will you use magic device check? Oh, 
Oh yeah, I guess that could help me with uh, mm -hmm. using, using my sword to go to. Oh. Well, I was actually still 14. Okay. Uh, you think you know how to do it. Might need to practice. I'm going to consult with my wizard. Yeah. However, there's one problem. It specifies that you have, it can only create rifts on the material plane or the vibrate into the gloom. You can't be in the gloom and create a rift. So I can't get back. You can only come back to the rift that you left. Or that you entered in. How long do those stay open? Uh, on the gloom side, um, it specifies roughly about a day. Um, on the material side, it specifies that it remains open for at least one month. Okay. Good to know. Okay. Violet. The books are gone. The books. Uh, what books. What do you mean? What are books? What? Has any more conversation taken place among... Uh, no, not much. Uh, she's, she's, um, she's in the state of mind to flip over tables and crack skulls to find out why her library has been, <laughs> um, not necessarily in that order. Desecrated this way. I tell her I'll help. Flip, flip the table or crack the skull? Why not? Both? Crack the table? I don't know if I can flip the table. Flip Probably the skull? Probably cracking skulls. I can do that. Yo, we have Mike, Mike 34. Mike, Yo, Mike. Oh. Buffalo a couple weeks ago. Hmm? Voss, you were a buffalo in a past life. Jeez. Voss is my hero. Okay. Other than that, you get no other information. Interesting. Can I, like, look around the library just to see, like... Can I go to the cooking section and see if there are any prison beckoning books there? <laughs> sure. Uh... <laughs> Roll a perception check. <laughs> <laughs> Ten? <laughs> Eleven. 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 Taking a Oception Lizard, wrapping it in bacon, and baking it. I don't want it. You have, to create, you have to create wings out of the bacon. <laughs> I want it. It turns into a dragon. I want it. Can you make me a curse um, baconing? You're not there. You don't know it exists. Um, is the one chick that was up front, is she the one? Is there another person that really works up front? Uh, yeah. She says, uh, we, we, have, we, have, we have a couple people that work up here. I don't live here. I have a life at home. I thought she did live here. <laughs> what? No, I don't live here. I thought she lived upstairs. Her tree's upstairs. No, the lady at the front desk. Oh, I'm asking his mom. Oh. What What about us? What are you asking? How many other people are here, like, essentially on watch? How many people? Uh, part of the temple or part of the library? So or both? Like a, oh. uh, roughly about 100. The list of names? Um, no. Okay. I, I, I refuse to give up the privacy that easily. Okay. This is an internal matter that I will handle myself. I don't trust her. Six motive. Sixteen. Um, you get the distinct feeling that she wonders why you're butting into her business. Okay. Fair enough. You wouldn't over it unmarried yet. It'd be like it'd be the same thing as some QA manager from another company going to JP and meaning, why the fuck do you do this like this? I mean, Can I get a list of all your employees? You motherfucking what? No! What the salaries do? <laughs> Social security numbers, addresses, picture you ID. Really get info easier than this? I say okay and I leave. Okay. Uh, as you leave, Elkos, you don't Want to check the place out? What do you mean? Uh, I don't know. Usually, Rowan makes me look around for things that seem out of place. Okay, fine. I'll look around. Yeah. <laughs> um. <Bye. laughs> 
Roll perception and sense motive, one after the other. Uh, 22 perception. Okay, that's good, that's good. Four sense motive. That's even better. Uh, <laughs> you get the distinct feeling that Elric isn't looking around at all, and he's using this as an excuse to spend more time with you. I'm gonna look around. Alright, well, your 22 perception eventually finds a room behind a room. Oh, wow, I actually Ooh, what? <laughs> Uh, it's, it's one of those, like, there's bookcases and there's a space between them. And if you shimmy th between them, you end up in, like, a small little, like, a broom closet. What's in there? Uh, a rift. <laughs> 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 a rapidly closing rift, but a rift nonetheless. Does it look like the other ones? Yep. So they came and stole all the books! So it would have been fresh, like... <laughs> Within a month. Well, you don't know that yet. Well, it's rapidly closing. Right. Theirs don't they? stay open that long. Oh, uh, that's right. You also know that they can open them in the gloom to get out. What? How big is it? Um, I don't know, about a hand span wide. So, so I can't fit in it? I mean, you could stick your head in. But if you go in, there's no getting out. The <laughs> and the party has no idea where you are. You know what? Go in. No, no. <laughs> I look down. Great, great she adventure. just has to level up a while in there. She's She'll be fine. She'll just grind Eventually, she just plays walks while. out. Finds us fighting prisons beckoning. Mm -hmm. I tell him not to go in. In our hour of need. <laughs> I wasn't gonna. <laughs> I didn't like the last one. That's fair enough. We should probably go back and tell everyone that there are imaginary hey, things. Uh, Ulrich and Rowan have the same feelings Hove does about going back in these rifts. <laughs> no. Went there once. No thanks. It's the... It's a good vacation, but I wouldn't want to stay. Right. <laughs> the chick that was crying, is she still here? Yep. Okay. She's at the front desk. Is it in the room that the other books are in? Uh-uh. Oh, it's in a different place? Uh-huh. It's like next door and around the corner. What books are in there? In the broom closet? No, like in the bookshelf in front of it? Right in front of it. Just random stuff on a seal. Where's the What's up? What do you guys want to do? Uh, wait, so we looked at the Burks. Yeah. You verified that you were in a time place that was very old than this. At this point, we're probably just waiting. Would we hunt? Well, I guess they're at a library. She's at a library. We could go see if we can catch her at the library. What's Rowan doing? Is he hanging out here too? He's gone. What a bitch. Now that somebody actually finally decided to look for him, he's at home. Oh. He's probably collecting fingers. Did he go alone? Sounds like a Rowan thing to He do. broke the rules. What Was he ever here when we came back? Mm-hmm. But then he left when we woke up? Mm-hmm. Okay. Your boyfriend's too sneaky. Yeah. Too sneaky five me. She's here in the bathroom, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> you hear a bunch of thuds from inside the bathroom. Oh. I think I found Rowan. <laughs> 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 You're grateful. <laughs> you just accidentally dropped your book. <laughs> I was reading like this, and I dropped it on my face. <laughs> ah! Uh, the bathroom. Vale, is Rowan in there with you? No. Oh, he's not here. He does that? Do I know where he is? Mm -mm. Okay. Ulrich's not with him. He's alone right now. Ugh. <sighs> I just like let out a sigh. I'm gonna come out of the bathroom. Okay. <laughs> With my book. Um, Violet. Yeah. As you stand there, just looking at the books nearby. <laughs> He's alone. I'm like, uh, a Damn flutter it. of wings. Uh, you you yeah. feel uh, a a slight wondering. whoosh of air. Whoosh. Air whoosh. Air whoosh. She's noting. Uh. I was like, how do I type this? Sorry. What is it? Uh, Do I you, see anything? Yeah, you watch as Luna dives straight into the portal. <gasps> no! no! <laughs> In Raven form, I might add. <laughs> no, she goes Varen at the last second. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't know. In true bird form. I'm not going after her. You Did you yell no? Yeah, I'm like, don't do that. I scream no. Uh, you hear someone go, Is this man bothering you? <laughs> Shoot. Oh my god. <laughs> No. Then who are you talking to? 
I was reading the end of a book and it had <laughs> an ending I didn't agree with. That cover up. <laughs> this is all current history. I know, I don't agree with a lot of things in current history. Did you know Donald Trump? <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen the state of our planet? Like, <laughs> Uh, the lady gives you an odd look and then leaves. Okay. Give her an odd look back. <laughs> Can I still see her? Or is she like? She's um sneakily looking at you between books on a shelf <laughs> from like eighty feet away. You should do some weird shit. Is it like really obvious? Like, mm-hmm. what can I do? She's pulling books off and sliding them so she can get a better look. She holds up a book but is doing this. It's upside down. (laughs) Guess is fun. Um. Okay, boss. Okay. That's a little bit more information than I wanted to hear today, but I'll take it. I could daze her, but I don't think that's very nice. <laughs> probably not. But I'm all for it. Okay, can I see Luna anymore? Is she. You could, just, you could probably just place, like, a door or a bookshelf or, like. Darkness. Boop. <laughs> 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 yeah, right, come here. Let me touch your face. Uh, okay. Boop. <laughs> you can't see. Fuck! I. Don't go in after her, and I like hurry out and like go back to the apartment. You arrive back at the apartment in a harried state where everybody else is currently sitting, trying to figure out where Rowan went. Uh, yeah, I don't know where he went. Huh? I was writing a letter. He was sleeping on the couch. Oh, ready. we gotta talk about his nap. <laughs> it's a hell of a nap. What? I like burst through the door and slam it open, and I'm like, guys, and we went to the library. Was Rowan there with you? No. But oh. there was a portal, and Luna went through it. Wait, what? what? There was a portal behind a bookshelf. All the Curse and Beckoning books are missing. They're all cookbooks now. <laughs> and Luna went through the portal, and I told her no, and she's gone. Uh, you guys hear a door open. As you watch as Elric begins to pull um, putty and a knife mm-hmm. out of the closet. For he begins what? fixing what? the wall that failed to smash the door. <laughs> Violet just smashed the door. Oh, I'm like, I'm just <laughs> we don't have door stops, like the little like, <laughs> springy things that catch the door. We haven't invented those yet. Yeah, huh? We're gonna have to. All right. Yeah. You know where Rowan is? Yeah. Where? What? Where? Where? Where Get, is he? Getting shaved. Shaved. Yeah. He's, He's a guy. He does stuff. that. Yeah, of course. No one's allowed to go anywhere by themselves what? now. What's shaving. <laughs> Please explain. <laughs> <laughs> we don't understand. Uh, ask Anna. How, how long? How long has it been? Like it was at noon. He fell asleep. Uh, it's like four o'clock in the afternoon though. He's been gone for four hours. That's normal. Where does he usually go? Yeah. I, th- I feel like this way. Uh, he goes to straight edges. Is he lying to me? No. That's a bunch of rulers. <laughs> How far is that? Uh, you you would know it as the place that Rowan always goes to get a shave, and it's in the middle of town. Why don't I go there? Not alone. Do we all go? <laughs> We're all going. We're all I'm going. Okay. Field trip. Eight people walk into a barber shop that has three people standing in it. This is a terrible joke. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, what? What's around it? Uh, just various stores. There's a chocolate place next door. I go there. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. It's it's the equivalent of um, <sighs> like good diet. Uh, no. Mallies. Gertrude Hawk. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No. Edible arrangement. Uh. Uh. So it's really expensive. No. Just fruit and chocolate. Oh, okay. okay. Everything's. Chocolate covered strawberries, chocolate covered cherries, chocolate covered blueberries. I'm like looking at something, but I'm like looking through the window to wherever she is. Yeah, are there free samples? You, yes. <laughs> you you walk into the barber shop and find Rowan sitting into the um, chair talking to his barber. Just give him a look. Yeah? That's the you're in trouble look. Uh, fine. So he's just been 
been like sitting here for hours. Yeah. One. He requests a hot towel. He goes over his face. <laughs> he sits there. <laughs> Where'd he go? What happened to the buddy system? We lost him again. What? What happened to the buddy system? You hear a muffled, I can't tell my buddy. <laughs> Who's your buddy? Steve. <laughs> Steve the barber. Yeah. Steve is not your buddy. <laughs> He's good with a knife. Are you done? Oh, fine. <laughs> we have important things to talk about. Apparently, uh... Are you talking to him in He makes a joke about how, I hope it's not about the ring, to Steve. And then they leave. He leaves it, okay? <laughs> Come on. While we're back, he's got stuff to tell us, and I gestured to my buddy. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> While we're back upstairs, and uh, right back in the apartment. <laughs> <laughs> and you'll be feeling good again. <laughs> tell me about your freaky nap. <laughs> tell him about my freaky nap. <laughs> Sounds like a freaky nap. <laughs> oh, and Luna's gone. She went through the portal. If you're ever bored, don't stare at my sword. <laughs> I wouldn't touch it with a 10-foot pole. Or even 10 one-foot poles. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, we're having a special kind of day, aren't we? Yeah. I mean, that sucks, but what do you want me to do about it? I mean, I was just letting you know. She comes back, she comes back. She doesn't, she doesn't. Should we go? What if they stole all the Christmas and Becky clothes? I mean, don't you need armor? <laughs> yeah. Oh, can You we should go get them? that. It's not time yet. System. Is it time yet? Can we go? Get the no, he has like another week and a half. <laughs> no, oh, he had a week like last time. Sorry, he has fucking six days then. It goes up every time. You're right? Yes. What is this? I'm going to level weeks. 10. Eight Still weeks. not that. <laughs> God bless. I will kill your blacksmith. And it'll never get done. <laughs> he's like almost Better done. Better than this. <laughs> you kill all the other people he's working on armor for. So they don't need it anymore. Mm. Then he goes out of business the day before he finishes my armor. I thought you were the good one. <laughs> that was actually. Oh, okay. So anyway, uh, what's the party want to do? I mean, I think I can open a portal. Should I try? I'm uh, probably not here. I put my sword away. <laughs> You're in your safety apartment. You probably shouldn't open a portal to the place that they're hiding in. True. Or you can. I mean, it's up to your health. I mean, I'll just stand outside the portal with my sword. <laughs> Come through, I dare you. Oh shit, that was enough. Some void guy comes through. Oh shit! <laughs> they, they, nope, nope, nope. They go back in. <laughs> well. Should we... Why would she just go in? She knows what's happening. Doesn't seem very intelligent. She might have a way out. It was almost closed. She might. She didn't know how they opened, so she could have a way out. That's true, I hope so. Anyway, uh, what's the party want to do? I'm tired of sitting around. We need to do something. I think opening a portal. Is there a safety about that? <laughs> if your is armor isn't like, done by the time Ashley's level like nine, thing. just have her fabricate it. I don't know. Yep. Yeah, there's some hey. houses. Be right back. We should go there. Okay. I mean, We're gonna pick one of the safe, safe houses and then go. Okay, I'm gonna be right back. What? 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 Um, the safe house in Portland. Hey Joe, you should probably cut something right here so it's not out in the open okay. or. Um. Well, I think next time we will go ahead and jump through a portal or something um this has been another episode of as far as you can tell i'm joe with me was andrea rachel ashley brad jp um if you want to learn more about the setting we're playing in you can go to zodiacempires.com you can also find us on facebook twitter instagram and all sorts of social medias and we will see you next time bye